bachelor's degree from Boston College in 1988 and his law degree from Boston College Law School in 1991. He was a law clerk for the justices of the Superior Court from 1991 to 1992, and there are still some members of the court who remember him in that capacity. So he knows our court well and is known well. For the last 24 years, he has practiced civil litigation with the firm of Doherty, Wallace, Pillsbury, and Murphy, PC. In that time, he appeared in many trials and other proceedings in the Superior Court and in other courts and has become well known to the judges, clerks, and staff of this court for his skills and accomplishments. It is apparent that Judge Callan is well qualified to sit on the Superior Court. We like to place the induction on Honestly, um, I'm going to have a few remarks. I'm going to ask uh, my former colleague and current district court judge, Bill Hadley, to present a few remarks, and then my father, Phil Callan, is going to have something to say, and then we'll adjourn and, and, get, to, uh, and, and get to our business for the day. Um, I think it's appropriate today, first of all, to just thank everyone for being here. Uh, really, um, the fact that everyone's here today for this event on a busy Thanksgiving week is, uh, is a wonderful thing. And I deeply, me and my family deeply appreciate it, um, everyone showing up here today. My family, it would be appropriate to, um, to talk about them just a little bit first. My wife Jean's here, and uh, you know, thinking about this week and thinking about everything that's happened over the last couple months, you know, everything has its um, genesis in things that happened a long, long time ago. And about 25 years ago, I was a law school graduate, and I worked in the Superior Court, and I was engaged to be married, and I went to my fiance, Jean Barillard, and I said, Jean, I think it's a good idea. I think we should move to Western Mass. We can, we can get jobs, and we can have a family, and we can, it's going to be great for us. And I think she reluctantly agreed to come out of Boston, where she lived her whole life, to come out to Western Mass, and I think, She'd agree with me if you asked her that it was a good idea and we've enjoyed our lives out here. It's really beyond my wildest imagination. 